Hi guys and welcome to my channel. In this video I'm going to do a lip swatch video of all of these. These are the uh, liquid lipsticks, what are they called? Matte Lip Liquid Lipsticks from The Body Shop. And for you guys who don't know, I used to work at The Body Shop here in Sweden, Stockholm. So I absolutely love <laughs> that brand. And I decided to buy them all, so this is not sponsored in any way. So I bought these for 95 Swedish crowns per lipstick. I can write right here what it is in like dollars. I think that pretty much every country has the body shop, so it's a very easy to find product. And as I have worn one of these before, I think they are very similar on the formula as the NYX Soft Matte Lip Creams. They do not dry like fully. They are just like a moussey, velvety formula, which I really like and I know that the NYX Soft Matte Lip Creams are very, very loved and I know why, because I love them as well. So yeah, let's go into the lip swatch. So the lightest shade is this soft pinkish shade that is called Taipei Orchid, number 20. And these smell so good. It smells like, um, does it smell like pear, maybe? It smells like the, um, the ice cream piglin, which I guess is a Swedish ice cream, but it smells really nice. So as you can see, it's, uh, it's not a sheer formula, but it's not like full, full coverage, at least not this one. This is the shade Windsor Rose, number 32. And it's like a light brown. It has like a hint of peach in it, I think. It's so smooth, like I love this formula. The only thing that is putting me off a little bit is that it is not like a full coverage liquid lipstick. So it's really hard for me to like overline my lips. <laughs> um, such a problem, I know. I'm probably the only one having that problem. This one is Nairobi Camellia, uh, number 34. I'm so sorry if I'm like pronouncing the names wrong. I don't know how to pronounce it. Um, but yeah, this is like the first one, but more nude and darker. Ooh, this was a lot more pigmented than the others. I am so impressed with the pigmentation of this, so I really hope that the other ones are similar to this because this is full coverage for sure, but it still has that very comfortable velvet feel. This one is Crete Carnation number 30 and it's like the second shade but warmer and darker, kind of. This one I thought would be darker on the lips, but it looks darker on in the tube than it is. Like they are so they're like a mix between the NYX soft matte creams and NYX lip lingeries, I think. Next up is this like neon pink shade. It is called Paris Peony number 22. I absolutely love these kinds of like neon pink shades. This next one is super cool. I love orange lipsticks like the uh, shade Orange County from the NYX Liquid Suede are one of my favorite, like all-time favorite lipsticks. Uh, this one is the shade Kelly Gerbera number 10. Oh, it's so nice. <laughs> this one is for sure one of my favorites. This one is the shade Tokyo Lotus. Lotus, that is such a Swedish pronunciation. Number 24. This one is a lot more pink than it looks like in the tube, but it's like a pinky purple shade. The next shade that I will be swatching is Sydney Amaryllis number 14. Okay, so next shade is this like plumish purplish shade. It is called Goa Magnolia number 26. It's a very like I just ate blueberries type of uh, shade. I don't know if you have noticed it throughout this video, but I've been really trying not to overline my lips that much, but I have a serious problem to like stay within the lines. 
These are the last three shades and it's the darker ones as you can see. This one is a dark red and this one is more like wine wine shade i don't know and this one is a darker like plum purple we'll go in with the red first this one is the shade tahiti hibiscus number 16. this shade was actually a bit hard to get even so i would suggest to wear a lip liner underneath and also i messed up the application i'm so sorry i just said i wouldn't overline my lips but here i am <laughs> Next up is the shade Moritrus Delia, number 17, I don't know. This shade is gorgeous. It's like a dark plum, like berry shade. Berry shade, I would say. Yeah, it's a dark berry lipstick. <laughs> Lastly, we have this super dark, I think, plum shade. It is called Sisley Iris, number 19. Yes, I love this already. Okay, you guys know that I love dark lipsticks, so this is for sure also one of my favorites. So that is all of the 12 shades swatched. And all I can say is that like, I really, really like them. I think these four are my like ultimate favorite. It's the neon pink, orange, uh, this one that I have on, and also like a mauve-ish, pinkish nude. A quick review though, if you have very dry lips, you will love these. If you love the NYX soft matte lip creams and also the lip lingeries, you will absolutely love these. They are exactly like the same like velvety finish. They feel super nice on the lips. I would really suggest so that you would use a lip liner underneath when using these lipsticks. It will last a lot longer and also if you use a lip liner, it will become like 100% full coverage because they are kind of sheer but yeah other than that I really really like them I think it's a great job that the body shop has launched these and yeah I'm super excited to use them so if you enjoyed this video please give it a like and please subscribe to my channel and yeah I hope we'll see each other in my next video bye